the lord said to me since you know the future why not prepare as if you are in the future what will you be doing in the future why not start it now i know i can't be small i may not know the exact place god is taking me to i have an idea of what it looks like so now for example i know i'm going to be filling stadiums all over the world i know operating supernatural ministry to kings to presidents to governors causing revival all over the nations of the world i am aware of it but what kind of regiment will power that life do you know what even as part of physical preparation i went to go and download english speaking course to learn grammar went to school prepare to take a phd form start calculating how many times will i be sleeping in a day when will i fast i'm telling you what i do okay how many books will i read in a month because what you will not get less busy that's the truth you will never get less busy except your impact has reduced except you have lost value so how do you add too many more things to your present schedule and still be relevant when should you wake up what are the first five things you do when you wake up i have to force myself you know it's sweet to say i'm praying mommy take the children to school you will by yourself stop that prayer carry your children to school and learn it now and that will give you details of my spiritual regimen it might be my work with god and it can put you under pressure but i'm just giving you physical things what about saving what about accountability how do you account for god's resources in your hand hello sir do you think you'll be great i'm asking you a question do you ever think you'll be great many of you say pastor i'm not thinking i know forget confession are you sure you'll be great why not practice greatness as if you are already there?